Well, right off the bat, it's already, you know, like pretty crunchy. What's it doing? It needs soap. It needs a <laughs> massage and it needs you to sing a song. Looks the same, just looks wet. Pull out its legs and arms. Maybe that's, oh, it's like a dissection. This, oh! this is for little kids? What's going on? Welcome to Dope or Nope, the channel in which we rate products dope or nope, obviously. Or we fall asleep because we can't decide if it's a dope or nope rating. <laughs> Wake up! Just me? No, just Anyone you. Anyone else could like use a good nap right now? It's because it's getting gloomy again. Like we had two days of pure sunshine and everyone was like sunroofs open, going to the beach. Sunroofs open, going to the beach. And now everyone's beach. like... I kind of dig this weather, so... Calm down, Tanner. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Super low tone. Today, we're looking at some of the worst rated products on Amazon. That's right, the team went out of their way to find products that were absolutely just trashed in the reviews. We're gonna buy them and rate them dope or no. Yeah. But how do we classify what a dope is? If the reviews were too harsh? No, I would say like it's a dope if it doesn't deserve to be justified. Yeah, I guess if the reviews are too harsh. <laughs> I was like, no, not what you said, but like, what yeah. you said in a different way. Okay, first product. Sharper Image Virtual Toy Ping Pong Game Set. Features built-in light-up ball. Integrated sound effects. Keeps track of hits, misses, wins, scores, solo. How do you, how, how are you supposed to hit it? You ever hit light? You're supposed to hit light? Yeah, you're supposed mm. to hit light. It's supposed to bounce, do some cool stuff. It like projects on the wall. Like, what? Okay. <laughs> Let's watch this little video. <laughs> it looks like it got stuck. I'm so confused how this thing works. Let's take a look at the reviews. I mean, this isn't that surprising. I use it, what, it, use it, you need a very <laughs> tiny room. It came with one of the paddles broken. What? Nice. <laughs> didn't realize you needed a completely dark room, so it's your fault. And even with that, I didn't ever figure out how to hit the extremely fuzzy ball of color. <laughs> <laughs> all in all, a waste of money. And the cart! Oh, that's... Oh, well, if oh that didn't break God. it... Glow sticks. Projects ball target on walls. So that looks like a fly swatter without the material. Look at this little thing in there. How do I turn this thing on? I just crushed Bob Oh, Ross. wow. It's like Tinkerbell. You never hit me like that. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's play against each other. Let's see how it goes. Stop beeping. Ow. No. Oh, I win. <laughs> we look like you apes. Look like <laughs> <laughs> Just swinging around. It made it honk. Oh, I'm green now. We were both blue. Oh. <laughs> how, is that, how is that possible? <gasps> we are playing single mode with two rackets. <laughs> 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 Oh, oh, oh! That's what you get for calling me. Oh, look, wait, wait. Look, that's cool. You can see the inside of it. <gasps> there was glass shards in it. That's why it wasn't working. <laughs> this is really bad. This is going to go into the worst product uh, hall of fame. Oh, all those worst products. <laughs> <laughs> Jello play slime making kit. Monster slime, 14.8 ounces. 100% edible. Play slime edible? Non toxic. Contains enough slime to make two batches. Oh, have you ever used slime in the past? No, I've actually yes. never made slime. You've, you've used it in the future? One thing about slime is that when you play with it, you pretty much touch every aspect of it. And now you're supposed to eat it after you touch, it. like literally, slime. It has this unique characteristic that it literally takes every Thing off your hand like a fingerprint like yeah it literally takes all the dirt the bacteria the grime and you mm -hmm. just kind of like roll it up and it's just like it's all in this little ball and then you're like oh it's like a germ collector yeah do not waste your Wait. money if i was looking at two of these canisters right in front of me i would have to think that this was some kind of joke <laughs> to get people to send money for a fake product well i am here to tell you it is not fake Wait, it is 100 percent real real cornstarch that is real slight green tint and a very slight lime aroma with zero lime flavor what are they talking about that's I'm it, so folks. confused it's cornstarch not sure why i wasted money on two can of cornstarch i hope you don't on a side note look at all the five star rating every single one is a review for a free product <gasps> conspiracy someone call shane sliders. dawson yeah shane dawson just comes here <laughs> y'all buying off all right roll this canister my way wow i just want to say this is an absolute work of art we got jello play monster slime it didn't need monster in it to sell but they decided hey what is one more relevancy point to kids kids love playing with monsters especially the ones under their beds the one-eyed green ones too yeah. monster zinc knock off am i right so here's the directions for it <laughs> you know what's life without a little risk you measure three level scoops of slime mix into the bowl you pour one scoop of warm water into the bowl and stir it with a spoon for 30 seconds and you add a tablespoon of warm water and play using your hands so it's literally just this and water 
water. Liz, bring it out. So I've pre-mixed a little bit. You just need to add more of that to it. This uh, looks nasty. Don't add too much Tanner. Tanner's really bad at this kind of stuff. I've, I've watched I've watched enough Rachel Ray. <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. This is goopy. This is kind of what my brownies look like when I'm done with them. Is that a euphemism for poop? My body brownies. <laughs> <laughs> my body brownies. <laughs> wow. Love slime. And that's slime. Okay, that's slime. Now taste it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's on Michael's shoes. <gasps> oh, you would have lost your life if that was on my shoe. I would end this shoot right now. Why would you wear white shoes to a doper nope's shoe? Michael, if you're that passionate about women, you would not be single right now. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna like that's I don't even want to watch him eat it. This is what I imagine Shrek tastes like. Is it good? It looked like you just ate a booger. Should I take a small bite? I'm gonna be honest. Does it taste like candy? No. But is it bad? Nah. It's not that bad. I just you can't eat more than a bite of this. I'm I'm gonna say nope. I'm saying dope. But that's just because I don't like slime to begin with. All right, guys, check this out. We're back on Amazon. Who would have thought for the whole Amazon video? Harajuku style styling products, hair color, wax dye. One time, molding paste, seven colors. You guys having fun without me? No. Shh. Keep going. Molding paste, seven colors, hair dye, wax. No. Hair dye is blue. Nope. Wait, it's like actually nope. blue? Nope. Neither of ours can dye our hair. It's too dark. I can't either. It's crazy. Okay, your beard. <laughs> Oh, you mean us. I thought said neither of us can die. I was like... <laughs> if this actually worked well, I would I would consider like doing blue tip. Oh, it, it's not permanent. It only lasts for hours and it washes out quickly as you jump in the shower. Let's look at the reviews. Not worth it. So even though the color was amazing once put through my hair, you literally can't do a thing with your hair once it's in. Blow it straight, nothing. What? I mean, I mean blow, blow it straight, straight. nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's add a cart. Throw that out. We don't need fake hair. We're doing it high stakes. <laughs> what was the point of that? In case you didn't want to do that on your own hair. Yeah, I'll fit in. And all right, we'll all dye our hair. Patrick's Day green. <laughs> we'll all dye our hair, guys. Okay. You want green? Yeah, I want green. We have green dye too, if you want it. Beautiful. And it'll help like grow it. Thank too, you. Which I think you'll like. Thank you. Your hair's you know short and. He already said thank you. You don't have to keep telling him. <laughs> wow, look at that. That's weird looking. I only see it. Wow. That's a lot of blue. <laughs> all right, I'll do your hair. Well, he's getting deep in there now. There's no way this is gonna look good. I have to go get lunch after this, Mike. I mean, look. I just looks darker. Yo, go harder. Man, the things I do for this channel. Thomas and Lauren too. <laughs> <laughs> you look so scary. Oh my gosh, Michael, it's too much. You said let's send it. So we Michael, sent it. you oversent it. <laughs> look how I look. <laughs> Michael, too much blue. We can just like, you know, like. Michael, really no. Hey, it's Why? payback time. I'll allow, because I did it to you. <laughs> and you guys both did it to me. <laughs> this is so disturbing. You look like your name is Penny. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, just a little with some streaks. Maybe I she banged. <laughs> That's like when you go in to kiss a girl and she like has regrets. I've never been swerved that hard by any girl, but Michael actually made me feel insecure. I was like, oh, no. Just some baby streaks, you know? Just enough to get the girls going. Wow, he looks so good. Yeah, that's an improvement. Look at how good you look. And tell me, oh, it's just the same. Yeah, I mean, you can see it, you know, but. Hey audience, we've learned two things. Either Michael has better hair, which is unlikely, or I'm a better hairdresser, which is more likely. Guys, before the next product, guess what? We're gonna do another like to live. What is a like to live? Live, you ask? Bad question. Don't ask that again. Next product. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> a like to live is where we ask you guys to like this video 100,000 times, and that lets us know that you really dug going live because we had to get the entire crew together at a different time, like shoot some live stuff. In previous like to lives, we've even had Rose live. perform live or unreleased track. So that was pretty cool. So if you want to see crazy cool stuff like that, first off, hit the bell icon so you know when we're live. Click like on this video, and that'll let us know you want to see more live stuff. All right, next product. You UFO detector, blue LEDs, internal magnometer interface with microcontroller for 24 seven days a week monitoring for magnetic anomalies that have been reported by many UFO sightings. Is that just a sentence or a title? That's both. Dude, you have two UFOs right here. <laughs> No, it's two, from... two aliens, yeah. 33% <laughs> of Americans believe in UFOs, according to no studies whatsoever. Oh, no, according to a 2012 study of National Geographic. Oh, God. <laughs> Is that real? Okay, let's look at some <laughs> reviews on this. Oh, what? Look, a customer image. Stop. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Are those skulls? <laughs> this is in, in literally graveyard. someone's like... Look, wait, first sentence. I am a scientist. <laughs> <laughs> like everyone else that has purchased and reviewed this item, I thought it was a hoax. Most, if not all, all of the reviewers plugged in this device experienced some sort of interface. <laughs> some sort of interface with a UFO? One guy said it, it does not work at all. This led me down a path to a little statistical analysis. Okay, get to the analysis. To make a long peer-reviewed paper short and abstract, this device is not a UFO detector. This device is a UFO attractor. <laughs> this thing is like the UFO alien version of Tinder. <laughs> 
He did not God. say that. <laughs> that says it right here. <laughs> Add to cart. Look at this. This elegantly designed conversation piece is designed to sense electromagnetic disturbances that have been known to coincide with UFO sightings. I think they're explicitly saying that it doesn't work. It's just a display. Mm -hmm. It's a conversation piece? It says conversation piece. Whoa, look at this, dude. That's not a joke. It's just a motherboard with lights on it. No. It's a, it's a motherboard no, it's with- much more than that. With dots on it, or Mike and Ike's. Oh. Okay. <laughs> What? <laughs> I think you just put it down and you just set this on top. Oh, and it's definitely supposed to go through this stuff. This is not a decal. We're scientists. <laughs> Did you say scientists? I love that worked so well with the bit. I couldn't even hold it. We're science. <laughs> Here's what I'm gonna do, guys. I'm gonna set this up outside my house. I'm gonna leave it there for a couple weeks and then I'll see if it works or not, okay? We'll give you guys some data on. <laughs> so done. Data analysis. Cut to. All right, guys. It's late right now. I'm at home. Uh, I am right beside my window. Uh, you can see I got the. Well, I can't see it because it's dark. But I have the product right here. If you recall when we plugged it in, I'm pretty sure it didn't do anything. So here we go. What? Are you for real? What? Why is it working now? That's not a good sign. I don't want to look out my window now. Okay, I'm gonna look out my window. <laughs> Little Live Scruffle Loves Plush Mystery Rescue Pet. Bronies are going crazy everywhere right now. Wait, why are they blow drying it? Because they just bathed it. <laughs> Did you say that weird? But the day the but day babe. <laughs> this kid is a different breed after lunch. I didn't know he would be a puppy, a kitten, or a puppy. Wait, what? Oh, what it like talking? grows in two. No, it can like grow into What? What are you talking about? <laughs> So I, I think when you get it, a mystery rescue pet. So when you get the package, you don't know what it's gonna be until it goes in water and you blow dry it. Is that how they think rescuing pets works? Oh, I got that as you got it dirty and then you gotta clean it. And then oh, it turns I into a rabbit. Like it turns into something. It's hard <laughs> So why do people hate this, Michael? Let's take a quick look. The Scruffle Loves worked out very badly for us. At first, it was a cute little ball, and then you bathe it. The drying part's hard. After we finished drying the Scruffle Love, it was too scruffy, and the fur got everywhere on the child's hands. A waste of money with this image. Whoa! I think it looks cute. Dude, it looks like... It looks like it needs rescuing, so I think it makes oh, sense. Oh, what if it smells like wet dog, too? You Ooh, ever, you know that like smell? musty. These things are terrifying. That's Hold funny. on, I need to see the owner's hair before we go in. <laughs> because we don't have any understanding that they might be able to take care of themselves. Imagine it's Tanner who submitted Wait, no, no, Tanner go back. submitted this go photo. Back. <laughs> Add a cart. Well, we wonder why they need rescuing. From owners like, <laughs> like Liz. Liz. All right, Scruffle Loves, who will you rescue? Well, that's, that's a little bit weird. Who will you rescue? It's not implying you're rescuing it. Oh, wow. Did you guys already watch this? No, that's how it comes, brother. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like those things from Star Wars in the bar. The truffle lumpkin. Is that what? No, that's not what. <laughs> and remember in the bar in the in the prequels? Oh, squeebins. Is that what? You're lying. <laughs> well, right off the bat, it's already, you know, like pretty crunchy. Pretty crunch. That's the meanest thing you could say to something. What's it doing? It needs soap. It needs a massage and it needs you to sing a song. It looks the same, just as what? Pull out its legs and arms. Maybe that's. Oh! It's like a dissection! This? Woo! This is for little kids? Are we birthing this? As a parent, I'm like trying to figure out a way, like how would I explain this while we're doing this? Hey, we're gonna wash it, and after we wash it, it gets birthed. Where's its face? Oh. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> that makes it better. <laughs> that, that's literally just me on a Friday night right there, you know? Wow, that's like, really look sad. Look at this poor. It's just lifeless, yeah. It looks like we're trying to save its life. <laughs> Stay with me, kitten. Dude, it looks like you got struck by lightning. Yeah. That's a nope for me, Bob. Nope. Now let me tell you a bad sign for every review ever. The first word is amazing. It's not gonna be amazing, but let's go ahead and see. Amazing, instant smile, cosmetic, novelty, secure teeth. So we got some teethers here. For aesthetic purposes only, do not eat or sleep while using this product. So what's the use case of this product then? Maybe you don't wanna be insecure when you go out. What? So you just want some nice teeth for one night. I don't know. What do you think it's gonna get you? Maybe yeah. a good kiss. A kiss? Just like a peck though. You can't like, you know, French. <laughs> you can't French it, because once you French it. Just like a peck though, so. <laughs> Those babies are gonna get loose. No good. Horrible. Okay for Halloween. <laughs> what? 
because not fit. Too small. No online instructions. Waste of money. <laughs> Waste of money. Out of the cart. When you got. Whoa. All right, guys. We have one instant amazing smile. Medium size. I'm currently waiting for these dentures to get a little bit heated up right now, and I'm gonna put the thermal beads on them, which is just a weird combination of words. I don't like that. At and all. I'm gonna put it in my mouth. And I'm gonna try and kiss Michael. Ew, dude. What are you doing? That's the near the beads along That's the That's disgusting. Oh, it's like adhesive. Are these edible? Sure. <laughs> What if it doesn't come off? I feel like I'm like Amanda from the Amanda show. Oh, okay, because I was about to fight you. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a bow in his hair. <laughs> I feel like I'm like Amanda. Oh! <laughs> it looks kind of real. They're way too low. They're not sticking well enough. Get close to the camera. Yeah, go up there. That's upsetting. I don't like it. Why do you look like a, a different person entirely? Who does he look like? I don't like this. <laughs> Down in the air! <laughs> Down in the comments, who does he look like? He looks like someone else. They do. <laughs> Amco three-in-one banana split tool. This cuts the banana. Oh, it's a banana split tool. Okay. Like for a banana split, like ice cream. Oh, it, got, got it. You half. split the banana in yeah. half or you can dice it up real nice. <laughs> Why not just use a knife? Or you do that for something. What the heck does that do? Just open it. You can it. peel it. It'll let you massage it. I just don't think this is going to work. Oh, I, I haven't had bananas in like uh, frosted flakes in so long like in your cereal. That was so oddly good. specific. Oh, I haven't had spaghetti in my tortilla. Because <laughs> the picture you're on. That's not Frosted Flakes. That's like multi-grain Cheerios. Yeah, this guy's like, I haven't had it in my Frosted Flakes in a while. I couldn't relate to that cereal, but I could relate to my Frosted Flakes, okay? This product is not what I expected. It mushes the banana when you try to cut it. Even mushes very firm bananas. <laughs> and the cart! Excuse me, what is happening? Sorry. <laughs> what the heck? That's not even what we bargained for. Yeah, it is. That's the um That's the slicer. <laughs> oh my god. I got goodness. this one. Can we have some snizzers? <laughs> and we have hot dogs. Hot dogs? That's oh, yeah. upsetting. Get those. <laughs> you like this? <laughs> I'm supposed to lose my life over here. <laughs> okay, so this is a firm banana. Harder. Harder. Well, that's, a that's a firm banana. That is a really firm banana. Well, now it's stuck. Whoa, this is like a weird game. <laughs> <laughs> now it's one of those math things that you use in math. I like digitize this banana. <laughs> okay, this is not meant for a hot dog. <laughs> no, no, this is what you do with the hot dog. Let me see. Oh, there try you to go. spice it, yeah. There you go. Oh. oh! I hate that! Oh no! Oh! What the so heck was that? To watch that? I feel like I just watched somebody get cut open from like <laughs> the half <laughs> <way> of <laughs> The sound is just the worst. Wanna split a banana? <laughs> <laughs> you see the goo? Oh, I hated that. Dude, give me one more banana. Don't worry, we're gonna eat all these. Oh, that's pretty cool. This might be cool for like a, like, like a fruit bowl, for like a party, like a, for a little fruit display. It worked. It totally worked. You just need firm banana. Make sure you get your hands on some firm bananas. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, bye. bye. Remote control realistic fake cockroach RC prank toys insect joke scary trick. Oh, it's a joke scary trick. <laughs> it's a what? It's a joke scary trick. I hate those. Just wanted to make sure I knew what it was. Those are so scary. Look at that, 15 centimeters. Cool light. Why is it so small? We're not trying to brag, but it's small. <laughs> Yeah, that's like humble bragging right there. Not realistic at all. Not realistic. Not worth what I paid. Remote does not work well. Useless. Completely false advertising. Product description is extremely misleading. Despite being an unrealistic, unrealistic size, the motor in which Roach is very loud and would give away the gag instantly. Oh my oh gosh. Oh my gosh. That's actually a creepy image. Why does that give me the heebie-jeebies? I hate bugs, dude. There's like the positioning and the lighting and the hand. I'm not afraid of most things, but I am extremely afraid of spiders, snakes, and all bugs. All bugs? All bugs. Good to know. Wait, what? Add the cart. I hate cockroaches. You know, we had cockroaches here once. Yeah. Because of Ikea. Can't trust those people. Well, we bought a bunch of Ikea furniture and like the guy delivered it and they all crawled out. And we were like, oh, great. And like found them for like months and months. Woo! Whoa. Let's do it. <laughs> is enormous. Ah! I tried to do it to you. Ah! ah! <laughs> we were both like, ah! <laughs> Well, I hate it. This is actually how cockroaches move. They only go one direction. Why does it light up? <laughs> Just break it right now. Ah! I don't want to be that guy, but they don't really have any flesh, so it's not really going to break anything on it. Ah! <laughs> Whoa! Holy! It Whoa! already snapped. I don't care. Uh, dude, it hit my knuckle. I was like, oh! It hit my arm and almost went to my face. Bro, it already snapped. <laughs> It's still a projectile. <laughs> like going like four miles an hour. Not when you're in shock. The cockroach live. Like they always do. <laughs> That's gotta be the world's dumbest product. I'm disappointed. 
Oh, what kind of aim do you have? <laughs> it just hits the wind. <laughs> All right, we got the Hydro Mousy Liquid Lawn System. Grow grass where you spray it. Mousy? They have this for hair. We mousy? Have a problem. Yeah, mousy, brother. Mouse. No, it's a little mousy. Nice save. So you can grow grass where you spray it. This seems extremely unlikely because I've tried using such on my hair. It never worked. <laughs> what has me and really we resorted to this? <laughs> yeah. And now look. What's really crazy about this is it has 1,400 wow. customer reviews and it's got one and a half stars. So this must be a real poo product. Why do people keep buying it if they see one and a half stars? Let me tell you. You know what? Even better than that. Let me one up that. Let's have Ro tell you. Buy if you want to look like a leprechaun beat you up. Worst what? product in terms of the use of use. That makes sense. Comes with this mousse conditioner that's sealed in the plastic bag, filled to the brim. It exploded on me when I opened it up and got green stuff all over my hands and face, clothes, and driveway, etc. If you wash and that's how dark it stayed, that's offensive. I that would is. be upset. Oh, so it's hydrosod. So you just spray it down and it's gross. Yeah, right. That thing puts out that much pressure. Does it grow grass out of that? Oh, stop. No way. He goes a week later, it's just turf. All right, let's 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 buy this baby and grow some grass. Skirt, skirt, see all the options. Wow, that's a device for you. Risky toss yeah, list. <laughs> So we got hydro mousse, so it's a water mousse. So you gotta set it to Wumbo. As you guys can see here, it has like light seed, heavy seed, it's got water, it's got off, so we're full set. Oh, it's not ready yet. Did you set it to Wumbo? What kind of grass is this? Yeah. Hillbilly fire? So it comes with the seeds and it comes with this mousse. And like everything great, all you gotta do is add water, everyone. Grass seed bag. 59% tall fescue, 19% shining star prenial ryegrass, 9% boreal creeping red fescue. Now read a word that makes sense. 9% shamrock Kentucky bluegrass. <laughs> that was the one I was looking for. Last week I tested it, so I sprayed grass on these things. Wow. Nothing Stick. All right, let's go spray it. All right, we're going full heavy seed here. Full heavy seed, light seed. What is happening? Oh, this is how grass is okay, made. Okay, now stop. Okay. Now, is that supposed to foam? It's supposed to be like a mousse. There's oh. no meat in there. I can that's promise you. That. Oh, there's like four seeds on it. It's just puking. That's really disappointing. Dude, this could be like a great like. Uh, I don't. I lost it. <laughs> I mean, as of right now, it's not gonna work clearly, but if you guys wanna see if this does work or not, we have a behind the scenes BTS, not the Korean K-pop band. If you guys wanna see the behind the scenes footage, go ahead and hit that join button down below. Do it. And then you guys get to see if it grows grass. It Do doesn't. It. So. <laughs> Everybody, we have something special in that. I don't know why I just resort to that accent. Everybody, we have something super special right now. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> and that is the join button down below. We have three different tiers. I am personally a two or three kind of guy. <laughs> so I'm I want to give a special shout out to Games Queens uh, because they are just a very special supporter of ours. And if you guys want to shout out just like Games Queens, make sure you guys go hit that join button, look through the tiers, and pick it so that you guys can get a possible chance at a shout out in the future. Pick it or stick it. Pick it or stick it. Now on to the next product. <laughs> dream until your dreams come true. Wall famous PVC wall sticker decal. My dream just came true. What does that even mean? All right, so it's a sticker you put on your wall. A dream sticker? until your dreams come true. Yeah. And then when they do, stop dreaming. Waste of money. Don't order. It's super hard and has many steps. <laughs> Not worth one dollar. The letters and words are jumbled. I once uh, got some of these, but it was literally like this. I looked at it and I was like, I'm not putting this on my wall. I'm not gonna like literally cut it all out, place it all, put it on the wall. It's like, I'll just paint Why it. Why couldn't it just come like just one big sticker? You just put yeah, it off exactly. and that's it. That's like, how it should come. Add a card. All right, there it is. That's it? Did we do this right? Yeah, we did. What the heck? You can't really tell on camera and that's why it's frustrating. Look, right yeah, there. it's not an actual decal. It's like a sticker. So you like in person, it looks like a really cheap sticker. Yeah. Dream until your dreams come true. I hate that. Why are you telling his face are like you that? Stop it, <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> 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 this is pretty bad. Guys, let me know down in the comments below your favorite corny phrase. Mine is keep it cobbing. Corn on the cob? Was a bad joke. With those teeth, you're just gonna cob all the time? <laughs> Something like that. I don't know. I don't like you with those. <laughs> I don't like you with those. So, no! If you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to hit that subscribe button right there in the middle and check out this video. It is the last Amazon return crate video we did. It was a blast. A lot of weird, crazy tech gadgets in there. And check out that video right over there. It is a video that YouTube recommends just for you. And if you enjoyed some laughs, let us know down in the comments below what your favorite part was. And we'll see you next time. Yeah, we will. Peace. Bye, everybody. I love you.